Zechariahu, Zechariah 1, in the eighth month, in the second year of Dari Yavish, came the word of Yahuwah unto Zechariahu, the son of Berek Yahu, the son of Ido, the prophet, saying, Yahuwah has been sore displeased with your fathers. Therefore say you unto them, Thus says Yahuwah Sevaoth, Turn ye unto me, says Yahuwah Sevaoth. And I will turn unto you, says Yahuwah Sevaoth. Be ye not as your fathers, unto whom the former prophets have cried, saying, Thus says Yahuwah Sevaoth, Turn ye now from your evil ways and from your evil doings. But they did not hear, nor hearken unto me, says Yahuwah. Your fathers, where are they? And the prophets, do they live forever? But my words and my statutes, which I commanded, eth my servants, the prophets, did they not take hold of your fathers? And they returned and said, Like as Yahuwah Sevaoth thought to do unto us according to our ways and according to our doings, so has he dealt with us. Upon the four and twentieth day of the eleventh month, which is the month of Shabbat, in the second year of Deriavish, came the word of Yahuwah unto Zechariahu, the son of Berechiahu, the son of Ido, the prophet, saying, I saw by night, and behold, a man riding upon a red horse, and he stood among the myrtle trees that were in the bottom. And behind him were the red horses, speckled and white. And then said I, O oh my Lord, what are these? And the angel that talked with me said unto me, I will show you what these be. And the man that stood among the myrtle trees answered and said, These are they whom Yahuwah has sent to walk to and fro through the earth. And they answered at the angel of Yahuwah that stood among the myrtle trees and said, we have walked to and fro through the earth, and behold, all the earth sits still and is at rest. Then the angel of Yahuwah answered and said, O Yahuwah Sevoth, how long will you not have mercy on Eth Yerushalayim and on Eth the cities of Yahudah, against which you have had indignation these three score and ten years. And Yahuwah answered at the angel that walked with me with good words and comfortable words. So the angel that communed with me said unto me, Cry you, saying, Thus says Yahuwah Sevoth, I am jealous for Yerushalayim and for Sion with a great jealousy. And I am very sore displeased with the heathen that are at ease. For I was but a little displeased, and they helped forward the affliction. Therefore thus says Yahuwah, I am returned to Yerushalayim with mercies. My house shall be built in it, says Yahuwah Sevoth, and a line shall be stretched forth upon Yerushalayim. Cry yet, saying, Thus says Yahuwah Sevoth, My cities, through prosperity, shall yet be spread abroad, and Yahuwah shall yet comfort Eth Sian, and shall yet choose Yerushalayim. 
Then lifted I up at my eyes, and saw, and behold, four horns. And I said unto the angel that talked with me, What be these? And he answered me, These are the horns which have scattered at Yahudah, at Yashara'el, and Yarushalayim. And Yahuwah showed me four carpenters. Then said I, What come these to do? And he spoke, saying, These are the horns which have scattered at Yahudah, so that no man did lift up his head. But these are come to fray them, to cast out at the horns of the other nations, which lifted up their horn over the land of Yahudah to scatter it. <laughs>